Thanks for checking in to Weatherbug here on this Thursday. Tom Nelson with a look at your National Coast to Coast forecast. And Romeo is looking for Juliet in the East Pacific. Tropical storm Juliet is likely to kind of just drift to the west away from Baja California, which is currently sitting in the southern tip of Baja California. But uh, we'll be watching that. Some of the moisture could get sucked up into the southwest, just like some of the remnants of Evo did over the course of the weekend. But the southwest really needs moisture. We could use some out near the uh, a rim fire in California, which is currently the seventh largest wildfire in California history. Now, when it comes to the Sierra Nevadas, this is the largest wildfire in uh, that history. Nearly the size of Austin, Texas, or about half the size of Los Angeles, 30% contained, and they do expect to see this continue for weeks. This is a look at the map. There's the rim fire. Yosemite National Park kind of just nosing into the northwestern side of the park there. All right, to the tropics we go. Still keeping an eye on little waves of energy off the western tip of Africa. And again, the the uh, Gulf of Mexico is quiet. We should mention that eight years ago today is when Hurricane Katrina in 2005 made landfall uh, near New Orleans. Tropical satellite showing that storm system Juliad drifting off to the west, seeing a little bit drier pattern now over the southwest, but still some thunderstorms possible and some flash flooding potential there as well. Moisture begins to round the outer periphery, this big dome of hot air, another impulse of energy through the Midwest today. Could bring us some severe weather into northern Minnesota but the heat really is the biggest concern. A number of record highs falling in the Midwest over the last several days. We're going to be well above average again today, just like yesterday. And that temperature trend will take a hit as we get into the second half of the weekend. But there's your excessive heat, which uh, continues in some cases through Saturday. Precip amounts on the northern periphery of that dome of hot air could be up to one or two inches or more.